You're watching Fox 5 News at 5. All right, it's Friday. That means it's time to go a little lux here on Fox 5. Tonight, Allison Morris is taking us to the Patek Philippe to see what goes into making some of the world's most expensive watches. In this week's lap of luxury, you may have seen Patek Philippe watches in store windows, but we're taking you behind the scenes at the headquarters of one of the finest watchmakers in the world. I don't know where to begin with Patek Philippe. They kind of have defined the luxury watch market. Everything's made by hand. Um, they don't use machinery. They don't use robots. Uh, limited production, limited distribution, limited manufacturing. And so it's not a watch that everybody can own, even if everybody might want one. Ultralux Swiss brand Patek Philippe has been making fine watches for 175 years. In the early 1930s, the Stern family took over. Now led by Thierry Stern, that family tradition is part of what makes this company stand out. I think this, the, the main difference still is the family ownership. Uh, most brands now are part of a bigger group. But it's the complicated craftsmanship that puts Patek Philippe in a category of its own. The watches take at least a minimum of a year to make. We have over 200 different styles, so everything is fundamentally a limited production piece. We have three watches here that kind of span the, the, uh, the brand uh, collection. And the first one we have is a ladies piece that is a very simplistic officer style, which means kind of a pocket watch look, uh, but it's actually an automatic self-winding watch. It's approximately 27,000, and it, uh, it has about 161 parts to it. Yes, all hand finished. The next level is called a doctor's watch, complete with a pulsometer you can use to track your pulse. This also, as you can see, with 269 parts, all hand finished, is, is really a masterpiece inside. It's approximately 81,000. The upper echelon, the 5216 in platinum. This ultimate collector's item is a special minute repeater that takes nearly two years to make. This particular piece has several complications, but the most noteworthy is it has a minute repeating chiming function, which will tell you the hours, the quarter hours, and the minutes on demand. It's about $700,000, and the price is based on the amount of hours it takes for these high-level watchmakers to actually accomplish the watch. But even if you can afford a $700,000 watch, you'll have to apply for ownership, and most buyers pay sight unseen. People pay for it without even seeing it, more often than not. Here in New York, you can see Patek Philippe's fine watchmakers at work if you're dressed for it. This is Patek Philippe's technical workshop where we're wearing lab-style coats and protective covers on our shoes to make sure we're not bringing any dust. As many as 20 watchmakers at a time can be working here. Laurent Junot is the director of technical services. He's been here for nearly 27 years. In this shop, there is 20 watchmakers, and we have different level of watchmaker. And you can see here all the steel part, everything is hand finished. The watches you see here are magnificent, but the granddaddy was made in the 1900s. There was a piece called the Grave Super Complicated that was uh, really wonderful. That piece has kind of evolved into the collector's holy grail. And that piece, uh, boy, originally went, I think, in 1999 for $11 million aftermarket. Came back up recently and it just sold for $24 million. Thanks for sampling the good life with us and checking out one of the world's premier watchmakers, Patek Philippe. We'll see you right back here next time on The Lap of Luxury.